solve the quadratic equation using the method of your choice. So we can do this uh, any way we like. So I'm thinking first, um, everything here can be divided by three. So let's do that first. So divide by three, divide by three, divide by three, divide by three, and then we'll see what happens. So this is x squared minus um, 12 over three is four, so this is four x, and then 12 over three is also four, and this is equal to zero. So now I'm thinking, you know, we can pretty much factor this, I think. I think this is the following. Let's try it. This is x, x, parentheses, and a zero. So we need two numbers that multiply to four and add to negative four. So I'm thinking two and two, and they're both negative. And that does work. x times x is x squared. Negative two times negative two is a positive four. And then negative two plus negative two is negative four. So it does actually, it does actually check. One way to check it, the way I typically do it in my head, is I do the middle term. The middle term is negative 2x. The outer term is negative 2x. And if you add them up, you get this one. And it does work. You have a product equal to 0, so you set each factor equal to 0. So x minus 2 equals 0. x minus 2 equals 0. So in both cases, you just get x minus 2. x equals 2, rather. <laughs> and that's the answer. So this is called a repeated real root because we get the same answer twice. So it's just one answer, but it's repeated. I hope this video has been helpful.